This edition of the Riddler Report is brought to you by Freekeen.com From Freekeen.com Quote, Cryptocurrency founder arrested by Manchester police for disorderly conduct of trying to leave his yard. Unquote. Uh, this must have been, I guess it would have been uh, early September 2018. Quote, MPD patrolman Ryan Olson prepares to assault software programmer and father Jeremy Kaufman. Originally streamed to his social media profile live, Jeremy Kaufman of LBRY.io has been arrested for disorderly conduct by a Manchester police officer for simply trying to leave his home. The Manchester Police State descended on Kaufman's neighborhood to conduct a homicide investigation in a home at 332 Hanover Street, which is apparently near where Kaufman lives. Apparently, this included preventing all the neighbors from simply leaving their own properties, a lot like being locked down in a prison by the guards. Kaufman, a respected software engineer and entrepreneur, currently CEO and founder of a decentralized blockchain-based media protocol called LBRY.io, recorded the threats and eventual attack by Manchester's police patrolman Ryan Olson on his smartphone. In the approx two-minute video, Kaufman is in his driveway and explains to the viewer that he is being kept in his property against his will by the arbitrary detention by MPD. He is not told he's a suspect in the homicide investigation, but is being prevented from, from leaving to pick up his son. When he merely walks down his driveway to investigate what is happening near his own home, Kaufman is threatened by Officer Olson, who tells him to go back that way. When Kaufman asks on what law he's basing his orders, Olson says, I'm not going to tell you again. When pressed to cite his statute, uh, when pressed to cite the statute, Olson pulls out the old police catch-all disorderly conduct. Seconds later, Olson leaves his post ac across the street, shouting at Kaufman, then manhandles him after telling him repeatedly to walk back, please. Please, is this a request or an order? Olson arrests Kaufman, charging him with a Class A misdemeanor version of disorderly conduct, which means Kaufman will be facing up to a year in jail for his heroic non-cooperation with the oppressive Manchester police state. He was released on PR bail pending arraignment in Manchester District Court. Here's Kaufman's footage, unquote. And then he links to a YouTube video, which I will probably link to in my video description. Um, as, as always, the free keen, well, as at least the free keen uploads that, that Ian posts tend to, they tend to be a little bit hyperbolic and uh, shrill, but, you know, you and I don't have to pay for what Ian does, and we do have to pay for what the Manchester Police Department does. Even if the former were terrible and the l latter were great, the former would still be better. For that one reason alone. Anyway, this is yet another type of incident where I went to sort of share the information with talk radio right when it happened, right after it happened, and they already knew about it. So again, uh, liberty is the you know the word is getting out about things that happen to liberty activists, whether I get it out or not, and it's happening on, in the mainstream press, and that's great. You've seen the dramatic Liberty arrests in Keene, New Hampshire. Now see 111 reasons why you should move there and reinforce these gutsy activists. Keene's advantages are compelling. For details, visit freekeen.com.